Hey, it's your boy, Chavo, coming at you with another video. This one is Protect Our Park's Best Moments, brought to you by Pod Mafia. So from my understanding, Protect Our Parks is like the Avengers of comedy or some shit, right? <laughs> they are the Justice League of comedy, right? And uh, I, I want to say I've seen a couple clips here and there, but uh, I'm excited. Let's get right into it. Hey, uh, what is this shirt you got on? <laughs> Explain what's going on. You got Save East River Park. What is happening? Oh, yeah. There's this fucking great park in New York. They're tearing it up. So they're oh, he's an activist now. God. <laughs> his old what are they different. doing there? Ugh. They said they need fucking barriers for the next Sandy thing. But... Let it go. Let the park go. Yeah, but is you, you also wrote that they might put condos up. Like They're they gonna. The right? They have so they put in the in the laws like like uh, in the sub whatever subtext like hey if we run out of money for this project we should be allowed to put in high rises or oh, maybe a prison to God. pay for it a prison which means that's what they're going to do oh, you don't want a prison there <laughs> <laughs> okay <laughs> I thought the tr I, I thought that the parks were pretty real quick if you ever get a chance to go to Mount Rushmore take that chance i'm telling you right now like it's cool when you see a picture of it but when you go there in person holy wow it is fucking crazy it was a good experience i just could not believe it that they built that shit on the mountain like just being there in person and looking at it was just fucking insane anyways let's carry on protected in new york city Except i thought that was the, like a vital you know, part of the city how old are you he's 80 47 yeah right <laughs> That's the year you were born. <laughs> Good year. <laughs> yeah, right. He always tries to get the the fat. All you gotta do is bring up Ari's age and he, <laughs> and he shuts the fuck up. <laughs> like a twenty year old. I'm older than him. Yeah, true. I'm like six years older than you. How old are you? I don't know. 47. Yeah, but you're doing pretty 47? good. <laughs> I'm yeah, doing seven. fine. <laughs> You're defending parks. I think <laughs> the park should be defended. Uh, fuck that yeah. park. Uh, fuck, fuck that, that park. park. And there's nothing I you can do. For real, fuck that park. Build I'm gonna that go down. You can bike the whole Build bike path past there. Who's biking, dude? Everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Who's biking, dude? <laughs> Who's biking? <laughs> Get rid of him. Uh, Let a guy make money. There's a guy right now. Somebody who's trying to buy this fucking park. There is. The last thing he, he needs is it. some dork coming on a podcast. It's probably being like, Trump. Protect the park, man. I hope it's Trump. Can you imagine if Trump. It turns you don't want to help Trump? Trump? Hey, Trump, why do you want this park so bad? Oh, you want me to do Trump? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's yeah. Trump. Trump. What's the problem with this park? Why do you want it so bad, Donald? We've got a lot of Jews down there. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Thanks. How'd you know that? How many Jews are there? Stop. No, keep going. Come on. No, no, what dude. are you going to do with the park? You can't. A lot of people can't. think Why? that you're going to put a prison there. Are you going to put a prison there? We might put a prison there. I haven't thought about it. We're thinking <laughs> about a prison. <laughs> so you're That's pretty a prison good. There. That's a good impression. That's a great. And Trump early on was like, we're pulling out of you, Afghanistan. You loved Trump. I do love Trump. Rub him? Yeah. But Did he I was like, rub? Yeah, yes. everyone got upset. Oh, is this Asian? Oh, no. Oh, uh -oh. shit. <laughs> going back Jamie, to your edit that in with like a loop over and over again. <laughs> you love uh, China. <laughs> Don't do it, dude. Did I say Don't it? Don't do it. You Did lost SNL. I said, it? I said it how you said it. it. I had an offensive line coach in college. I farted during a team meeting, and yeah. he stopped. He stopped the film. He was like, "We don't do that in here." What? What? And I was like, "Yeah, well, we all do that. <laughs> it's the yeah. only thing we're doing." <laughs> That's not the N word. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, like, I feel bad for these mayors because like they went into it, they're like, "We're gonna change, I guess, the school system, maybe pave some roads," and then they're like, "Handle a fucking international pandemic." And the They'd be like, "What are you oh, talking about?" My, that's right. what they've been that's jerking off thing. over. They're like, "I wish I had all this." Yeah, you're right. This More is power. my city. Whoa, Whoa, he looks just like Andrew Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. Uh, Epstein and good. Andrew. What? What? What is going on with that? Another guy re just retired because uh, he got caught up in uh, the Epstein photograph library. Mm. They found out that he was hanging. Meanwhile, Bill Gates out there selling vaccines and soybeans. See the picture of Bill Clinton and him just chilling at a, at a bar, uh, at a just restaurant. Just hanging out, having a good time. I only went on a flight with him 26 times. He's probably Trump was there, but he only went down there and he hung out with the staff once he found out what was going on. Did he? Yeah. Now you got to imagine, Harrisburg Comedy Zone, dead, and then there's a guy on stage who's clearly on meth. 
Shout out Heath Queef. And he's like, uh, <laughs> Heath Queef. He's, uh, he says, uh, I, I figured out how Barack Obama got his name. He had an Asian, an Asian doctor named him. Uh, his mom was on the table, and she's like, "Doctor, what is it? What is it?" And he goes, "Oh, it's a Barack baby." <laughs> <laughs> and that's where Shane got his love for Asian is humor. Is that funny? I saw Jordan Peterson. He did a Schultz's podcast, and Schultz's like, "I don't know. I'm just telling dick jokes." And Jordan Peterson's like, "That's important. We need that." You bloody need that. Yeah. Keep making fun of my weight. I'm not making fun of it. I feel uh, I'm legitimately concerned for you. I'm not making fun of it. I think it's Dude, fine. You know what we like, need to do? Was, you know what we need to do? What? Save the park, man. <laughs> you pussy. <laughs> Bro, let's save the park or something. I'm 70. Oh, my God. With his frail bones. Waving a sign. Kids play there. You're the guy doing Tai Chi at 4 a.m.? Yeah. He's holding up a sign with his bad shoulder, and it hurts. With none of his antibodies? <laughs> Zero antibodies. Biden voter, dude. I've been Sweet friends man. with Ari since he was an open micer working yeah. as a door guy. He still hasn't yeah. gotten better at comedy, but <laughs> just to... How has he not gotten better? <laughs> <laughs> he went a little Trump there. How is he? I mean, how... Honestly, this guy... <laughs> I can't do it with the headphones. You can do it. You got I'll it. Take the you headphones off and do it. You had it. Ari Shafir, yeah. what a loser this guy is. <laughs> yes. <laughs> He's 68. He's 70 years old, this guy. They tell me how old he is. He can't be this old. He is this old. That's amazing. <laughs> That's great. That's amazing. Hey, what am I going to do with that $1,000? I'm actually back. I drank <laughs> enough to be to back him. on Lewis. If you donate back. something I hate, I'll be so I'll mad I'll donate it to get rid of the East River Park. Damn it, Joe. <laughs> yeah. God damn it. I'll donate it to the real estate developers. They're like, Wait. what the fuck is this? Let's put all the buy Tesla's there. Buy it. Buy the park. Joe, you buy it. Joe, buy the park buy out. How much is a park? How much can you get a park for? I don't know. Dude, you can do it, dude. A lady who's running New Zealand, if she even gets asked questions at press conferences and people yell out questions, she goes, we're going to shut this down. We're going to shut this down if you keep yelling out. And oh, then she wow. just leaves. She She's goes, like a lady Trump. Credited, credited press only. And so she leaves. Like She she took the fucking press conference indoors. I'll tell you I understand what, if, what you say. If Joe Biden was here right now, I might give him a knuckle sandwich. Dude, you should. What, what would you say to him? If you were Trump and you were talking to Joe Biden? Wow, this guy. What a failure. <laughs> Why is that, Trump? <laughs> I feel like what about sons would get his along. Pants? Do you think he pooped his pants? Is that real? Yeah, yeah they would. A lot of people say he pooped his pants. He went to the Vatican. The Pope, more like the poop. That's what we said. <laughs> poop. A lot of us had a lot of jokes about that. Poop Benedict. <laughs> or whatever. Randomly, two times in my life, I sat next to him on a plane. Just that totally random. So weird. I remember Vancouver, yeah. Ransom at the airport. Yep, once in Vancouver and once somewhere else. And the last one... He was talking about, yeah, I quit smoking. He's telling me how he quit smoking. Yeah, I got, it was hard. It was really hard to quit. And I did it. And, you know, fucking smoke, it's terrible for you. So we land. He walks as fast as he can off the plane right into one of those stores and buys a pack of cigarettes. <laughs> and he's opening up it, and he's got one in his mouth as he's <laughs> he out went, the door. He went off for an hour about how it's terrible for you. He's so glad he's out over it. So I'm outside with him. I go, what are you doing? I thought you quit smoking. He goes, yeah, but all it's that dumb. fucking talking about it, I wanted a cigarette. So was he being funny? Or was he just a weirdo? No, no, no. He was just a genius. I didn't mean, drive, I think right? His didn't drive. he not drive? He invited people yeah. to go do tennis and stuff, so he'd be like, pick me up on the way. <laughs> his brain was just wired different. Yeah. It was just wired different all the time. But, like, he just decided, wow, let's smoke. And just, yeah. I mean, he couldn't light it quick enough on the way out the door. <laughs> well, it was cra I'm going to go smoke a cigarette. All right, uh, <laughs> what? Talking about cigarettes. You got a piss? No, I was talking about go. cigarettes. Oh, okay. I got a piss. I'm, it's not Chad a lot Hanks of good. Fucked. It's like that old expression. Yeah, he does a lot of Chad rapping. Chad Hanks is not fucked, dude. Wagwan, Tim Hanks, White boy summer. <laughs> Chad Hanks. White boy Shout summer. Shout out, Chad Hanks. Them rude boy. Them real rude boy. Chad Hanks. Hold it's on, on hold the on. way. We're going to see it's it. on the way. Get it. Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's, a That's like a little trumpet. That's a you know keeper. Funny? That's why we do this. A lot so, of guys got excited about fucking your butt after hearing that. Like, that is a tight little trumpet. <laughs> Bring you know, it it's on, some gays. Dumb, some bitch scientist is going to be on that mic. Like, hey, Joe, <laughs> have you thought about this? <laughs> <laughs> some bitch Just scientist. Talking straight you, to a fart. son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah, Joe, My Joe, fourth fart. I need to tell you about this. <laughs> no, give me Trump. <laughs> I thought that was Trump. Trumpet. No, Joe. Give me, was give me Trump, Trump with scientists. Joe, there's a lot of scientists out there. There's these guys that come in here. They talk to you. They don't know what they're saying. They talk to you about getting pussy. I get pussy a lot. Of guys. <laughs> <laughs> I got head. Made a single meme. 
I made you know, a like, couple. They're fun. Have you made a couple? Yeah, yeah, yeah you yeah. make a meme. It's fun. It's a yeah. style of thinking, <laughs> yeah. though, that you don't. You could be a guy in a cubicle. <laughs> <Okay>. Yeah. <laughs> analysis, Shane. Yeah, you make a meme. It's pretty good. And yes. they look at us for expert analysis. Beer number ten. Look at this We've fucking got, pile. Look at so fast. Some of them are from the Russians. A lot of people are saying the Russians are making the memes. <laughs> I don't think not we, good. I don't think Russians have comedy not clubs. Not good. Do they? Uh, how am I supposed to follow that guy? Yeah. And then everybody would be like, yeah, how is he supposed to follow him? No. <laughs> Real talk. Oh, yeah. Bitch, I wish you would burn my motherfucking clothes. <laughs> Real talk. You gonna burn what? <laughs> I wish you would burn my motherfucking clothes. <laughs> That's it. We need to try for the mask. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> what are you looking at, bitch? <laughs> okay, so that was uh, pretty entertaining, I gotta say. The fucking Shane Gillis and his Trump impressions. Holy wow. <clears throat> but that fucking R. Kelly thing, man. God, I hate to admit this sometimes, but I was like the biggest R. Kelly fan, man. What is it about my favorite artists that just lose their marbles, right? Like, I was I was a big Michael Jackson fan. Look at him, right? <laughs> Fucking R. Kelly, look at him. And then Kanye, I was always a big Kanye fan. And that motherfucker is just wild, right? <laughs> but anyways, that was like a small little clip, right? So, whatever. But Shane Gillis with his Trump impressions. Dude's fucking funny, dude. <laughs> Protect our parks. That was the first one, and they have a video like this for all of them. So you better believe your boy Chango is gonna fucking come through with those, right? I forgot who, but someone suggested this. Shout out to whoever that was. I appreciate it. Um, my only hope is this doesn't get taken down. I've had a few like Rogan things that get taken down, so we'll see. We will see how that works out, right? But I'm excited. There's fucking there's an infinite amount of these. They're like on ten right now, right? Like I said, I've seen a few of them, but I've never actually watched the podcast. The one I was watching, I was watching the Silver October one, and uh, that was pretty entertaining, right? But uh, I haven't really had a chance to watch these. Sober October was cool because the whole, I, I like when they did the whole like working out program. They were like competitive against each other, but I want to say they only did that like once. And that was it, right? It was, they, they got too competitive, they got too crazy, and they couldn't sustain that. So, um, but yeah, comment down below if you guys enjoyed this. Go ahead and hit me up with some likes. That gives me an idea, that gives me, uh, that lets me know that you guys enjoyed it. And that lets me know that I should keep it up, right? <laughs> and, uh, and if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. And when you do, welcome to Team Chango. I am excited to have more of you on Team Chango. And while you're at it, go ahead and hit the notification bell so that way you get notified every time I post some bangers, right? Um, and just so you guys know, I think it's lame fucking asking for likes and all that, but it helps your boy Chan go out. So go ahead and do all that stuff. Go ahead and, and I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys some homework. Go ahead and like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, comment down below and go ahead and share it. <laughs> Anyways, that's all I got. You guys take care. Peace out.